Well, the solar eclipse is just days away now, and schools are making sure that students get a chance to experience it. The last total solar eclipse in America was back in 2017, so it's a pretty big deal. Rachel Ramsey is here for you now with more on what schools are doing to celebrate safely. Yeah, Sherry, this is an opportunity for everyone to experience something that doesn't come around too often. The solar eclipse is set to start right before 2 p.m. next Monday, so most schools will still be in session. At Bath High School, the astronomy class may just be offering some extra credit. This isn't going to happen again for another 54 years, so they better take this opportunity to go outside and watch it. Kelly Scott teaches astronomy at Bath High School. She says she plans to give her students a lesson on solar eclipses, and she really wants the kids to watch it happen. So if they do and take a picture safely, there may be some extra credit. I think they get too focused on their own lives and what's in that little computer in their hands. They don't pay enough attention to the world around them, and they need to see the beauty and the grandeur of the world and the, the universe around us. All the schools we spoke with said that eye safety is very important. It's the top priority. That's why Kelly gave her students these. They're ISO certified eclipse glasses. And if you're planning on watching the solar eclipse, you're going to want a pair. Because if you look at the sun for too long, and I'm talking, you know, could be a minute, then you can literally burn out the nerve cells in your eyes that make you see. John French with the MSU Abrams Planetarium says it's important to check and make sure your glasses are completely black when you put them on. The only time they should have light is if you're looking at the sun. You want to make sure that you don't have any holes because any little hole like that can let enough light through to damage your eye. French says the next time a total eclipse will come to Michigan is in 2099, and this is something people shouldn't miss. A total solar eclipse is an amazing thing, and you know, there's really nothing else like it to witness on Earth. Potterville is letting students out early so they can experience the eclipse at home. And like Bath, Hazlitt is giving out glasses for their students to watch. Some districts, including Okemos and Heartland, Heartland have sent out eye safety reminders for glasses so students can witness the eclipse at school. This eclipse will finish up just before 4.30 p.m. Sherry, back to you.